Yep, this is my BMW X1 uh, two liter diesel manual X drive. Um, it's quite well specced. Um, it's got full leather, black leather throughout uh, with heated front seats. Um, it's an M Spot model in this beautiful blue color, which we'll have a walk around afterwards. Get a good look, look for that. Um, yeah, the car starts. Every time on the dot, car comes with two keys, um, a full service history uh, via the main dealer. Um, I have all the service book, all, all, all the various handbooks, uh, wallet, including including the um, logbook. So if we run to the nav, I'll just run through vehicle history yep so bring up the service history on the car um, you can see there's nothing outstanding and this had services at nine miles which would be a delivery inspection 12,000 miles 22,000 miles and then 45,000 miles um, the car is currently on just over 46,000 miles so in the, within the last five six hundred miles it's had full service engine oil uh, brake pads front and rear brake fluid um, microfiber microfiber filter microfilter for the vehicle inspection um, and as you'd have seen it's also got a full um, a full MOT uh, which has no, no no advisors at all. Um, so heated front seats. I'm not sure what to cover off really. It's got various map settings. Um, it's got limiter, active cruise control with a brake feature. So you can set the cruise and then you can nav navigate it back with the speed here and the car will slow down and speed up, which is quite a nice feature for them to slow down. Like automatically put the brakes on. Um, comes with auto lights, um, auto wipers. Obviously, a lot of things are automatic on this. Um, for the boot, also automatic. Powered tailgate. Yeah, overall, it's a really nice car. The condition is really good inside. There's no tears or marks on the leather. The leather is in. Really good condition. So as you can hear, the engine is running. Sounds like a diesel. We'll do now, we'll do a quick walk around and then we'll jump in the engine bay. This is the back of the car and the side. The weather's very gloomy and rainy today. Um, it's not the best lighting for, for the paintwork to really, really sh show how good the paint is, um, how good the condition is. But I said, it's also got a reversing camera as well. medical kit and the tire repair kit from Move. Both haven't been used or opened. Um, it's got an additional cigarette lighter in the boot, as well as this cool feature, which will feature in another video, so we flick the switch. It flicks the front seats forward, and now the middle one. And now the far right one on this side. Look at that. So all the seats in the back are now fully foot fully forward, allowing you to fully utilize the whole boot. It's got the twin sport exhaust on the back. Run around to the 
her wheels quickly. I did replace one of the front tyres. I think it was this one. Uh, zero balls when I bought the car. Um, so that's got no miles on it at all. Other than driving to the MOT centre and test driving the car. Um, diesel. These seats pack up. One of the really cool features I like about this car is if you need more space in the boot, you can adjust the rear bench. You can either recline the back bench more, or if you want to, you can actually move, move the whole bench forward. So we're so it's fully adjustable. Creating quite a bit of additional room in the boot. So let's do a quick walk around. As you see, bodywork is in brilliant condition. Yeah, any, any inspection is welcome. Um, obviously the car passes MOT with no advisories. Um, the MOT tester was surprised to hear the car's kettle gas, um, which I'll explain to you now. I'll also insert some pictures of the damage here. Right, so if you hadn't realised, if you hadn't realised already, the car had a front impact here. Um, as you can see, I've not cleaned the engine bay at all, um, deliberately, so any potential buyer on inspection can see there's no oil leaks on the car, and I'm not trying to hide anything. The car is a very honest, genuine car. Yeah. All of this was replaced, all of this, all this down the front, and the bonnet. Uh, and predominantly, the most of the impact was here on this side, as you can see from the previous pictures. Um, yeah, you can see it all lines up really well. Um, yeah.
you cut the video there. Um, any questions, any additional videos, pictures, please just give me a shout. Um, please drop me an email, give me a call, and we can sort it out. Um, yeah, as a, any inspection is welcome. Car starts on the, on the money, um, and the car is ready to go to find a new home now.